Hey there. Hey Leo. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Yeah, I'm fine too. Thanks. So, what are your plans for uh, Halloween? Halloween. Um, a friend invited me to a party. Would you like to come with me? Um, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, I don't know if I'm busy or not. What? 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 Oh, wow! <laughs> what the? <laughs> Got you. The control surface looks awesome, Stefan. Totally agree. Thanks. One idea that hey, I had... Something's wrong with the webcam. Hmm? Hmm? Everything looks fine to me. What's that? That's <gasps> wrong. Ooh, scary. Ooh. Hi. I'm Leo from Boings, and the demos you just saw were all made with the new Halloween pack for Memo Life. With it, you can add spooky visuals and effects to your video, and together with the Virtual Playout plugin, use it as a camera input in Skype, Hangout, and many more. So now, over the Halloween season, you can use it to spice up your next video call and prank your colleagues and friends. How much does it all cost? Well, we decided to give it away for free. But not only that, over the Halloween seasons, we offer you a free trial of Meme Life if you haven't purchased yet, so you can check out the Halloween pack and get familiar with Meme Life. To get started, head over to boinks.com Halloween. There you can download the Halloween pack itself, fill out a form for the free trial, as well as downloading the virtual playout plugin which you need for Skype and Hangout. At first, let's take a look at what comes with the Halloween pack. As you can see, we have 6 layers and 1 filter. To import them into Mimo Life, you simply open them. But we'll first take a look at the Halloween template. We added this template to give you a quick look at some of the layers without the need of installing them. So to get the template into Mimo Life, you simply open it as well and Mimo Life will tell you it was successfully imported. If you now open a new document and under template select Halloween, it will start a new Halloween document. As you can see, Mimo Life already added a lot of effects, like the zombie wandering around. If we take a look at the layer settings, we can adjust a lot of things and let animations happen, like the zombie grabbing after me. You can also adjust the speed of the fog or the size of the spider web. You can play around here a lot and adjust it to whatever you want. To customize it more with the other layers, you need to go back and import these. I already did that, so if I'm going to add a new layer and search for Halloween, you can see it offers me all the layers from the pack. So let's try to add another zombie and make him a bit smaller and faster. If I hit it live, it will walk around on the screen. Another exciting feature we added in version 2.6 is the ability to remote control Mimo Life from any browser capable device. That way you can use your iPad to control what's happening on the screen. All you have to do is go to the preferences and under remote control check allow remote control access. Now take the device of your choice and in the browser enter the address shown. Here you select which document you want to control. Of course we only have that one open so we'll select Halloween. Now you can add a new control surface. You can have multiple control surfaces so multiple people can control different things but We'll only need one, so we'll give it a name. We'll leave the width and height as it is and click Save Control Surface. We are already asked to add a button, so it offers us all the layers we are having inside our document. Let's try the zombie and we have different options here too. The most easiest one to use is the one down below, which is already pre-configured to have all the important buttons we need. Let's click add button and add another button for the mystic fog. Here you can just drag in the live button. Very simple. Let's try add the lightning flash and we have another configuration here which adds another button to trigger the flash. To use the buttons all you have to do is click live on the top right corner and by clicking one of the buttons you're toggling it live. So if we go back, I can just let some zombie walk around or start the fog. I can also let the zombie grab me and all that stuff. Just from my iPad. Very easy to control without fiddling with buttons in Mimo Life or anything. 
That's it for now. Don't forget to download your free trial of Memo Live and check out the Halloween layers. Also, feel free to send us the ideas you had on how to use them. See you again in the next video.